cycles like this one here, things need to sound exciting, right? So we got an X9000 controller here. This thing is a beast. <laughs> Check it out. All right, this is Bruno Power here. Quite a few people, they figured out that it's very hard to pack cables inside this area here in the bike, okay? So normally all the cables are bunched up with the bike wiring harness, everything is up there. And there's also room for more connections down here, okay? So there's more sensors, motor sensor, uh, the phase wire connection, kickstand, lots of things going on down here as well. So. It's actually a lot easier and less painful during the installation process to send some of these cables down here, the bulky area of the cables like this, and then send just what you need back up there, okay? So you don't introduce more cables in the area that's already busy. Um, and yeah, so that's gonna make your life a lot easier. You might shave the installation timing like by half, okay? Because that's the most painful part of the setup. Be showing the difference between the Talaria cable and the Suron cable. The Suron cable has got the black connector and the Talaria is just easy to remember. Technically, these two connectors could go together like this. Okay, so they're identical connectors, male and female. Suron, different connectors. Okay, very easy to remember that way. That's it. All righty. Just a quick demonstration how much room we got under the bike here behind the bash, uh, bash guard. So look, I can actually pack all these big connectors, this whole thing and it's gonna turn down to nothing so there's so much room down there look that that one's gone this one here gonna be gone there too look gone behind everything you can actually keep pushing push more look gone so now what about these ones here same thing i do a little twist which here gone it's like a, a dark hole where everything disappears here. So look, and that's it, gone. Ta-da, everything gone, gone to the dark hole. <laughs>